Hi everyone, welcome to Speak Easy. I'm Hasleen Kaur. I'm an actor and I've recently, you must have seen me in a movie called Tu Chuti Mein Makar or Cat on Netflix. Um, I've been a model, now I'm into acting and um, I'm here with Idiva today to talk to all of you. I think I'd auditioned for an ad for Dove, which I got rejected in. Um, I had gone to Malviya Nagar in Delhi to a studio and uh, was sitting outside the studio with a whole lot of other candidates and we were all like waiting, fingers crossed that we'd do well. I did the audition, came out and I never heard from them. Most famous contact on my phone has to be Shraddha Kapoor. I'm a Scorpio and I can't stand, uh, that's a tough question. Who's the most annoying? I think it'll have to be my husband, Aquarius. <laughs> Childhood celebrity crush was Hrithik Roshan, yeah. It'll have to be, Shraddha Kapoor. Tu Jhooti Mein Makar audition was uh, quite easy. It was more improvisation. Uh, they didn't give me a script. They just said that you've woken up in the morning and you've had a fight with your husband and you're just telling him that you had, through the week, told him ye ye karna, ye karna, ye karna, ye karna and he's not completed any of those tasks. So you have barged into the room and you are screaming at him. Uh, which is quite normal. It's the order of the day, I guess, in my house. It's a very normal morning, so it was. It went very easily. Uh, I came into the room, scolded my husband, and that was it. It was a great feeling to represent my country at an international platform along with 90 candidates. There were women from all over the world, all beautiful girls, intelligent girls, all who knew how to put their best foot forward. Um, but at the same time, I knew what I was bringing from back home, representing my country, the people, its culture, um, you know, constantly showcasing that we are intelligent people, we are well-spoken, our culture is, is you know, it's a, it's a mix, it's a melting pot of so many different things, so many different civilizations that have come into our country. Uh, you know, they, it's, it's a mixed bag of everything. So I was representing so much on that stage. Uh, not just myself, and I had to make my country look good, which was very interesting. Uh, and getting exposure to um, uh, to a country like Philippines and the people over there who are completely pageant crazy themselves because Sushmita Sen had won Miss Universe over there. So they were quite in awe of the India candidate. So I had, I had lots of people who wanted to come and meet me, talk to me, get to know who Miss India was, who Hasleen was. There was a lot of media attention that was given. Uh, so it was one of the best experiences to experience that. Ranbir. Ranbir has very serious onset. He likes to be in the zone, in a, in a character. He likes to see the entire set, how it is in totality. Um, the, the camera work, to the direction, to the way the production has happened, to how the other actors are on set, how well prepared they are, how they are planning their scenes. So he used to come and discuss every little nitty gritties on set with the other actors and we, even with the director and the costume department. Like he was fully focused and into that whole thing. Free love for me is being extremely comfortable with or without each other. Whether you're physically there with each other or you're far apart, but you're very comfortable in that space. So, um, you know, you're not, I think love means to be able to have easy communication, not be, uh, you know, not, not complete, like for example, Couples that are constantly breeding down each other's necks, like who want a lot of attention, who want a lot of communication, and those who feel that love only happens that ways, I feel that's not love. Love is very non-verbal, 
love does not have to be communicative all the time that you're talking to your partner or you're receiving some communication from that, that partner. For me, love is just being quiet and still receiving that love, whether you're physically close or far. Hi guys, like, share and subscribe to IDWell.